<laughs> How the first day of school feels in other parts of the county as well today. Chula Vista Elementary School, the district also returning to a hybrid model of in-person learning. ABC 10 News anchor Mary McKenzie has the story from the South Bay where people have been hit disproportionately hard by the pandemic. With the strains of Frere Jaca played in the background by students together at Lauterbach Elementary, Jesus Hernandez was beaming as he listened to his daughter Victoria back to school in person today for the first time in more than a year. I'm proud of her. Yeah, because she learned, she learned to, to uh, she got better during, uh, at, during, during the, this whole year at home. Just, just uh, learning on, in front of the screen, yeah. So uh, I'm proud of her. Chula Vista Elementary School District back to learning in person. The principal at Lauterbach there to greet families returning after what for many has been an unthinkably difficult year. At a disproportionate rate compared to the rest of San Diego County, people in the South Bay have lost more loved ones to COVID and were hit harder with higher case rates and hospitalizations. These families have been challenged to adjust to new patterns of remote learning and balance economic hardships. Staff and faculty of schools in the district working to prepare classrooms to receive students who played their hearts out and worked so hard at home. We know what our families have been through this past year, and no one would ever want to go back and relive this past year. And so this is a new day. The district expects close to 60% of students to be back in class. The model is a hybrid, half day of instruction either in the morning or afternoon, Monday through Thursday, with Fridays reserved for distance learning. Mary McKenzie, ABC 10 News.